Hey Sagittarius, what's the deal, y'all? Um, you realizing looking back and the things that you have broken down and rebuilt. You looking back and you reflecting on how it's not that people don't want to do good. Um, they haven't realized why they're doing the things they're doing. They don't have an answer for it, so they keep doing it. And some people are enjoying it. Okay. It's like people not going to change until it affects something big in their life. People don't change until it hurt enough. So you realize that, that these people have their own life lessons to learn. That's why you over here sending your Empress Emperor energy. You realize people have conflict within themselves that you don't have. Because you've gotten over the things that they're going through. So you better understand them than they understand themselves. And you could help them, but you at the point where you can't and you do not feel like com uh, repeatedly, excuse me, uh, saying the same things over and over. And these people are not going to either get it, they're going to judge you for it, or you just don't have the energy. This is some kind of information you can give to people helping them solve their problems and shit that you should be getting paid for. Especially when it has people out here that are like financial advisors, you know, people that help people budget their money that's on a certain level when it comes to that money, honey. They're getting paid for this. Therapists, psychologists, they're getting paid for this. And you're not. You see these people... It's going to be hard for them to look within. You know how hard it is to get over or to let go or to um, stop denying or take your problems head on. That shit's not easy. It's not easy to let go of addictions and things like this. And you see that all around you. It's like you're on your way to victory. That's why I love these cars when they was popping out because this is exactly how... Things are going. It's like you realize people really don't believe in God. Or you realize that they're so behind in what they need to do in life. That they really think that they can do shit. And no one's looking. They don't believe that their God is looking at them. No matter how you explain it to them. Or if you explain things to them and just when you think you're on the right path with people, they go and show you unconsciously or they show you that they know what they're doing and that's what they choose to do. They're happy with doing it because they haven't had any serious consequence and some have. They're just not learning from it and it's really not your job. It's kind of like you realize that in order for people to learn, they have to go through it them goddamn selves. They're hard-headed. And uh, Sagittarius, we don't have to get burnt by fire to learn from it. We can look at other people in some situations and say, you know what? I ain't doing that shit. I'm not going through that. You can look at people and use them as examples. Sagittarius' job is to go out, get information on Jupiter, the biggest planet. That's why you're always feeling like you want to learn more or you want to understand more or do more so you can come back and teach other people or tell people what you've learned. You go to the source. And sometimes the source is you. You learn from your problems too. It's like people can learn so much from you. Just the way you moving like you do. Yeah. So while you over here cadillac or someone think they got it going on and they can't, or these people can't even look within, they really don't have a choice. People really think they have free will and they don't. They think they have choices, but they don't. They judgment is fucked up. It's not because the way they was raised and all this. It's their judgment. People know what they want to know. People do what they fucking feel is right that they should do. And you like, man, you know how you have to sacrifice to get things in life? It ain't even about working hard. 
So you might see a lot of people that got expensive cars or got it going on in their life, but they just, it's like, okay, if you got all this going on, why aren't you helping people? Why aren't you like a celebrity? Why don't you have any real success? It's like you're just working hard for material things. So it's like it's levels to average ass people just like it's levels to bombs. You got a bum on the street to a bum that want to use men and women to get things they, they don't want to work for. Or that they mentally cannot get. And they could have a mental problem. So you see it's just levels to this shit. It's levels to people that work hard to become... Uh, it's like you you have no choice but to become famous or have support if you're helping people. It's really not a choice. So it's like if you're on this world just to work hard to get that Mercedes, that Bentley, or that big house, then what the fuck else is there? It's more to life than you just taking care of your family and just worried about your generation. So you could buy more things for your kids and compete with the next uh, family or brag on what you got, whether you have kids or not. Yeah, these people can't even get in route. So you have a, uh, I feel like this is your energy and you recognizing that you need to break habits and things with people that cannot get to that money, honey. Or they really don't get the that this pinnacle is not just about money. It's the magic. What you giving people is way more important than money. Money can't buy knowledge. Money can't buy common sense. Money can't buy a peace of mind. These people want to look good. With material things. Look good because they the boss or something. Want to look good because they parents and father figures. They want to look good because they're married. That shit ain't nothing. What I tell you, it's nothing. That's why I feel like the conflict within yourself trying to understand people is over. You don't care to understand this situation. You don't care to understand whoever this mother figure is that's connected to a broke-ass person or a father figure is that's connected to a broke-ass person. You get it. They have nothing going on. And this is why they're watching you. This is why they're watching you. Because there was no conflict to begin, boo. You're too smart. And you too, like you better than this shit. You're not better than people, but you better than the bullshit they try to pull at you. This person wanted to hurt you and didn't even put no energy into doing anything. It's probably like you just hurt because if you heard this story that was done to you, done to someone else, you would think that was fucked up too. And it just happened, so happened to be you this time, right? That people want to play with. What needs to be resolved set right in your life. That's how you looking at these people. That they don't get. And there's nothing you can do. But be quiet. And observe shit. Yeah. You're not changing your perspective. What did I say? This is your energy. Emperor, Empress energy. Let me hurry up. I want to make this video short y'all. Yeah, you see that the conflict is over because there's no prosperity, prosperity and growth. Even with these people, kids, they just going to be average, selfish ass people. That's not trying to do anything with their community. And if they are, it's really just to manifest something back just to get more material shit. Because even bad people are people that know how to manifest will manifest it, but it's not fulfilling. What I say is not fulfilling. Because they can't look within and genuinely help people and be there. Or if they want to help you, it's because they got some agenda on it. What situation in your life is calling you to be logical and have clarity about these relationships? That's what you've been doing. That's why you're going to be successful. 
You're going to be mirroring with this for your protection of what's important to you. Yeah. You are not keep, you're not being silent. You're just not, you understand these people. What situation in your life needs to be logical about? Yeah, these people have no choice that they, you see these people can't be logical. You can sit there and talk good things to these people and they'll turn around and tell you the most dumbest shit that, and show you that they just don't get it. And the person you were dealing with is one of these average ass people. They're not passionate about anything. That's you. Because this person can't do shit. They stuck. They might want to send you a message or they got the fucking message that you was delivering a lot more than just worrying about yourself and trying to shine and impress people. Having babies you can't fucking afford or you can't empower to put some wisdom into. Yeah, these people don't even work on themselves with the eight. That's why they're in this estate, huh? Let's roast them real quick. These people just don't get it. And you learning that your person is one of those people that you wouldn't deal with. It's kind of like your person is one of them bosses at work that give people a hard time. One of them, them neighbors a Karen at the store. That's what your person is. Your person is a Karen. They don't get it. And we laugh at that shit. Yeah, they be bitching for no reason because they can't get shit resolved in their life. Ooh. Yeah, they second and third guessing. This, uh, you be uh, second and third guessing these people. Proud community, what the fuck is up? Yeah, you see that these people see that you have morals and character. Or you have morals and characters and you fucking dress the part. Huh? That's why these people mistake you for you to be one of them. They think because y'all the same race or y'all dress alike or y'all got the same style. They don't go. They're not going by getting to know you. They just think they already do. Yes. There is no conspiracy. You get your information that these people are broken and they can't look within. So it's best that you not even say shit, friend, and do what you need to do. These people are.